What's good ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a series where I like to call Would You Want It Wednesdays, where every Wednesday, not every Wednesday, but on Wednesdays I review products and you guys can see if you guys want it or not. And today we are reviewing, oh, Yummy Nummies, oh yeah. You guys have seen Yummy Nummies before, a lot of YouTubers have done uh, reviews on it and I've done one uh, with Heart before, we did donuts and this time we're gonna do tacos. We're gonna make tacos and you know me, I'm all about that organic life so it's very apparently so of course yummy nummies these are really organic guys this should be really interesting because i don't know how to cook so this is the closest thing that i'll ever get to cooking as of right now and it has cheese in it great well it has cheese in it um which i don't like so there's another plus hi barry oh all right so on the box it says terrific tacos maker Make six deluxe tacos and three limeade flavored drinks. Oh, I didn't even know that we're supposed to make drinks on this one. Okay, so let's wing it. Let's give it a shot. This could be a total nightmare or this could go really, really well. We'll see. So it came with this plastic tray and it has um, plastic spoons on them and these little packets, these fun packets. Tortilla, drink, what, drink poison? Oh no, drink, <laughs> drink boy, boyzon. Boyzon, it says drink B-O-I-S-S-O-N. So I'm really glad that's not poison. Sauce. Sauce, of course. And um, cheese, mmm, yum, my favorite. Meat, it just says meat. I'm pretty sure this isn't meat, but okay, okay. Let's give it a shot. Not gonna lie, guys, I'm not the best at following directions. Like, I suck at doing like projects at school and stuff like that. It says, number one, remove the tray packets and utensils from packaging. Use scissors to cut the kitchen magic tray along the indented lines, okay. So I'm gonna start cutting. So far, so good. Open the tortilla 90 packet. Tortilla, tortilla, boom. Tortilla, yes, tortilla 90 packet. In tray one, mix six rounds, eight scoops of tortilla powder and two square scoops of water. Okay. And six, nailed it. All right, so now we're gonna pour two Scoops of water. One and two. Separate the mixture into two equal sized balls and place one inside of each mold in tray two. Flatten the dough inside of the molds using your finger. This is not looking good, by the way. Done. <laughs> and then microwave the tray for 10 to 15 seconds. Wait one minute before carefully taking out the tortillas. Easy peasy. So now we're gonna open the taco meat packet and put it in tray three, mix four scoops of taco meat powder and three scoops of water. Spread the mixture out evenly, covering the bottom tray. Microwave the tray for 10 seconds. Immediately begin chopping up the taco meat within the tray using your spoon so the meat looks ground up before equally distributing the meat into the center of the two tortillas. Ah, my favorite part. Open the cheese packet in tray four. Mix two round scoops of the cheese powder and one square scoops of the water. Cheese packet, oh my gosh. I bet it's gonna smell so bad. Oh! Babe, look at this. That's gross. That's just gross right there. Why would you do that? <laughs> <laughs> You're uh, red. Is it bad? Can that I smell is like it? the worst smelling cheese ever. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my gosh. It's Parmesan. Oh, you're crying. Ooh. All right, two scoops of this. <laughs> Let's do it. I know did a bad move. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. One. Two. And one scoop of water. Look at that. It's beauty. That is not beauty. It's beauty. All right, now open the taco sauce packet. So two scoops of sauce powder and one scoop of water in tray five. Scoop the cheese mixture from tray four into one of the plastic bags. Cut the tip of the bag and squeeze to add the cheese to the tops of your tacos. Using the taco sauce mix in tray five, repeat and add the taco sauce in the same plastic bag. This is so gross. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You're laughing at my cooking? No, I just think you're in a bad mood because of the cheese. I am in a bad mood. <laughs> the funniest thing. Once I got a whiff of that cheese, I, I was not feeling this anymore. Hopefully this will cover the flavor of the cheese. Oh, Fonse. It's the weirdest looking taco ever. It says to fold your tacos, place them on a plate, and it's done. I don't think this looks done, guys. Pretty sure I did a bad job. <laughs> this was a taco fail. Okay, now I'm gonna fold these tacos and put it on this plate. Taco number one, yay. 
Hopefully this one will stay. Oh, nope. This one's gonna break apart too. All right, look at my two tacos, guys. Ta-da. So now I'm supposed to enjoy this delicious meal with a nice cold beverage. So let's hope I don't screw that up. <laughs> this should be easy enough. It literally says open the drink packet, add one scoop to a plastic cup of water, and you're done. I should be able to do that. This is like a shot, like a little mini shot. Ooh, it's fizzing. Can you guys hear that? What the heck? I'm nervous. I'm so is nervous. This it? That's it. What? This is my meal. <laughs> I'm gonna take a picture of this real quick. Your dinner tonight. My dinner tonight. If I throw up, it's not because of how nasty this taco is. It's strictly gonna be because of the cheese. Because that, oh, that cheese is horrible. I'm gonna have the trash can right next to me, just in case. No, you can't. What? You want me to throw up right here? No, you can't throw up. That's the oh challenge. I don't think you're gonna throw up. Cheers. Why did that taste pleasant? Oh, we're not bad. I honestly thought that I was gonna throw up because of the cheese, but I didn't even taste the cheese at all. There you have it, guys. I guess I'm somewhat of a chef. The ground beef really tastes like, you know, like a taco. And the cheese, I'm so happy that I didn't taste any of that. But the dough, like the text, not the dough, the tortilla, the texture of the tortilla was so weird. Probably because I did it wrong, that's my bad. But this might be a weird um, explanation. It tasted like a taco flavored donut. I'm gonna give myself a D minus on this project because it turned out really horrible. My plating is not even impressive at all. It doesn't look pretty. But overall, it was edible. I didn't throw up. It's a success in my book. So based on what you just saw, um, never mind my cooking skills. Is this something that you guys want? Like, would you purchase yummy nummies and like try out these fun little projects at home? And it's edible and it's just a fun thing to do at home. I personally would want to try more. Is this something that you guys want? Let me know down in the comment section below. That said, I love you guys. And until then, I'll see you next time. And cut. Eat the other one. No, 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 don't make me do it again. <laughs> I think I got lucky on the first one, so no, I'm Did good. No, I'm good. I'm gonna throw up for sure. The name's Arnold, aka Mr. Hart. My grind never stops, no need to press start. All I do is work, ain't nobody that can stop me. My girl has a meeting, guess who takes her there? Me! Aw, oh, yeah, what you know about my swag? Looking like a boss as I hold my girl's bag. Y'all can't touch me, I'm as fast as a jag. You know who it is, it's the king of boyfriend tag.